Hello everybody, it's Mick here, and uh, today my wife's gone. She's uh, gone on some girls trip for a few days with some friends of ours. And so it's just me and the kids. The kids are down there uh, trying to drown each other. And I'm going to be right up here working on the boat. Remember the free boat I got? Let's start fixing it up, or trying to anyway. So here's what I got. I got it off the trailer, and I, I've done a few things here. I took some of the I took the rear bunks off the trailer because they were just all dickered up, kind of like the front bunk up there. So I'm going to take the front bunk off. I got to pull these tires off and uh, check these springs and and the uh, spindles and everything. Make sure what kind of shape they're in, and uh, I'll probably take the rollers off too. Put new rollers on there or a new roller on the back and take the lights and stuff off because I'm going to buy all new lights for it. And uh, I started pulling the transom apart on the boat, and as you can see, look at that. Yeah, it's uh, it's uh, it's in bad shape. So I'm gonna pull all that out and replace it. So uh, that's what we're working. Oh, check this out. This was in the back of the boat. I might uh, I don't know, clean it up, put it on eBay or something. But it's an old uh, Pepsi Cola uh, bottle top remover thingamajigger. So I don't know, maybe it might be worth something. You want it? Give me an offer. It just, it's uh, got a little surface rust on it, but I think if I clean it up, probably it's in uh, good shape. So, I don't know. But anyway, uh, that's what I'm gonna work on today. I'll keep you posted. Oh, check this out guys. We didn't get very far, but I found something. And uh, I, wanna, I wanna test the age of my viewers. So if you know what this is, or you've even used one, I want you to put it down there in the comments. So check it out. Who knows what this is? Huh? You haven't seen one of those in a long time, have you? This was laying in the bottom of this boat. That's, uh, I think that's about how long it's been since this boat's been used. So if you know what that is, put it down there in the comments. Or if you've ever used one. I've never used one. I'm young enough. I know what they are, but I've never used one. At least not on a, well, not on an adult uh, beverage. I can't, I don't remember them being on soda cans. I'm kind of giving it away now, but yeah, blast from the past right there. All right, here's the, uh, the update on the, on the boat and trailer project. So I worked on it, uh, I don't know, three or four hours, and here's what I got. I got the boat all stripped down, well, as far as hardware. But I got the transom all ripped out. As you can see, I have a lot of holes to fill. So, because uh, I just I just drilled everything out. It was everything was so rusty. Uh, I guess they didn't use stainless hardware back in the 60s or something when they put this thing together, because everything was rusted all so bad I couldn't even get to the part. So, I got a buddy of mine that is a welder by trade, and I'm hoping that uh, I can just uh, take it over to his house and have him fill all those holes for me and we'll be good as new. And then uh, the trailer, I got it all broke down too. And uh, that's basically what I got left that we're gonna use. It's just the frame and the axle. Uh, I think the, the spindles, from what I can tell, seem pretty good, but I am gonna get new wheel bearings and uh, caps for them. And I think we'll be good to go there. I think the spindles are fine there. They've been they're, they got good grease in them, and they spin freely, so I think we're good. So, uh, trailer's going to need uh, a new uh, uh, coupler, coupling up there in the front. And uh, I got the, the winch off. Uh, I'll need the actual winch, but the winch stand is good, and the front bunk stand is good. And uh, we're going to buy new lights and bunks. And I think we should be good to go after that. So uh, hopefully this will be a pretty easy project. So uh, the next step I think is going to be to get all the holes fi filled in the boat. So maybe that will be my next update on the boat project. So I'll let you guys know. Thanks for watching.